Hello everyone. If you have good luck, whatever you lay your hands to do moves without a hindrance, without a delay. Someone with good luck in business, you see your business moving so easily. And today, I want to teach us how you can attract good luck into your life by carrying out just a simple remedy. Good luck, it's something that I enjoy so much, using just a simple remedy like this. And I want to share with us, like for some of us who go for interview, you go for business transaction, you go for um, contract, so you can apply this remedy and you will come back with your testimony. Welcome back as I dive in into the video proper. My name is Mandy and you're welcome to this great family. I will not forget to appreciate my returning subscribers. Those of you who keep coming back to watch my videos, God bless you so much. I will not also forget to appreciate my first time viewers. Those of you who have viewed my video for the very first time. My name is Mandy. I am married with three kids. I am from Enugu State by birth, but from um, by marriage in my state. Okay, in this family, I share with us tips on spirituality, tips on DIY, and beauty tips also. So you're welcome to this great family, but for you to be part of us, all you have to do is to hit that subscribe button. The subscription is what's absolutely worth free. Then turn on your notification bell so that each time I upload a content like this, you will be the first to be notified. Share my videos, comment on my videos, okay? God bless you so, so much. Welcome back into this family. All right. So in this spiritual remedy today, we will be needing just three ingredients to carry out the spiritual remedy. We will be needing three items. The first item we'll be needing here is our Onalia perfume or Bintel Sudan perfume. If you cannot get your Onalia perfume, make sure you get your Bintel Sudan perfume. Okay? Then the next thing you will need is an egg. You're going to get either your native egg or your normal egg. Okay? Then the third thing you will need here is a Lux soup. Either you get your Lux or Joy soup okay so three good items your onalia or bentel sudan perfume or uh, then your joy or lux perfume just a white soap and your egg or native egg all right i have alternative for the three items onalia or bentel sudan joy or lux soup native egg or normal egg all right so when you have these three items what will you be doing with it now remember when you are seeking for good luck or when you wish to have good luck you must be positive all right your thoughts must be positive you must be positive to yourself saying to yourself that i have good luck you have to affirm it to yourself firstly that i have good luck i am not a child i'm not a person of bad luck whatever i touch is of good luck anywhere i go i experience good luck in my business there is good luck in my family there is good luck in my academics there is good luck you affirm this to yourself affirm it so that your your spiritual energy we absorb it and know that you're positive about what you want to do now after doing that you are going to get a white bowl just like the plate i am using to place this get a white bowl then you break the egg into the bowl break the egg into the bowl then you get your perfume either the onalia or your bintel sudan remember this is the color of onalia you must use for this remedy i have my reasons for saying so okay whatever i teach is what i have tested so i wouldn't want you to use another analia and tell me this or that okay use this particular one if you cannot get it make your order place your order from me you can get it okay so that is it so you break it break the egg into the white bowl then you get your onalia perfume or bintel sudan perfume which i do not have here now 
then add a little quantity into the egg and mix both of them now when you mix it after mixing it you take it into your bathroom you are not going to wear your slippers when taking this bath okay you get into your bedroom bare footed when you get into your bedroom you're going to apply those two mixture from the crown of your hair to the sole of your feet if you're somebody that made his or her hair if you're a woman you can apply it from your face down to your feet okay now after applying it what are you going to do you are going to declare your intentions remember you're carrying out this remedy because you want to attract good luck into your life you are not carrying it out because you want to stress yourself you're carrying it out for a purpose numbers 14 verse 28 says as surely as he lives whatever he hears you say that is what he would do for you so therefore you're going to declare the word that you want to see create what you want to see using your mouth you're going to create what you want to see after the spiritual exercise remember this assignment will be carried out by 12 in the midnight okay by 12 in the midnight sorry i'm repeating everything because i wouldn't want a lot of questions so you're carrying it out by 12 in the midnight after applying it you're going to create the world you want to see create what you want to see by declaring your intention you want to attract good luck into your life you declare that as you use this to bait you remove whatever that is causing bad luck or whatever that is meant to cause bad luck in your paths in your part in life that as you cleanse you remove it and that you attract good luck into your life you bring in good luck you attract good luck for your business for your marriage for your children for everything concerning you you bring in good luck you attract good luck as you're applying it on your body you're declaring your intention okay so after applying it on your body the next thing you're going to do is to get the logs or joy soap that you have there it's a white soap so if you cannot get joy or logs make sure you have a white soap a white soap okay so you get joy or logs and use it to wash yourself you're not going to use your sponge you're going to wash yourself from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet wash your body after washing your body you're going to allow the water to dry in your body okay remember water is purifying and is cleansing so as you have done that with that soap you have if you're doing that you have washed away whatever that will lead to um, um bad luck and you have bringing what good luck into your life so that is it it's very easy very simple I just thought I should share this remedy with us. This and return.